We are at $102 in three passenger rides. I ended up cherry picking a small $20 ride from LAX to Long Beach. Dude, there was a $24 ride, 467 rated customer, but I had to pass because it was gonna put me in West Hollywood and I didn't wanna do that drive with a low rated customer. In hindsight, that might have been okay because I ended up waiting another two hours at LAX, but I'm in Long Beach, I'm right by the airport, I might be able to get a ride to Anaheim, and that was the whole point. And there was a freaking $65 ride to Irvine from LAX, Uber XL, that would have been money on a Wednesday, but I didn't match. Let me show you my Uber driver app screen, $102 in three trips on a Wednesday, the goal is to get to 150, but if it's hot, we'll go to 200. You are watching The Art of Cherry Picking, episode 18. My plan is to get to Long Beach, or Palos Verdes, or San Pedro. That is the goal. I am right here in LAX. I wanna go in this direction towards the beach. I wanna avoid going any other direction. From here, I can basically end up in Orange County, which allows me to cherry pick and get a ride going home towards Chino. I definitely do not want to go towards West Hollywood. There's too much traffic there, right? And not only is there too much traffic, you already saw me pass on a rematch from LAX because it was paying me $24. It's not worth it because then what are you going to do once you're in West Hollywood? You're going to compete with other drivers and it's going to force you to drive in the streets where there's a lot of traffic. Now, I'll consider going to Burbank from LAX. Why? Because from Burbank, I can get to Pasadena. From Pasadena, I can possibly get a ride going home, right? It's not 100% guaranteed, but the chances are great. And I'm by the mountain. So I'm gonna sit here at LAX, unfortunately wait almost two hours, but work on my YouTube channel. A little preview of where I ended up after I cherry picked. There's another one that popped up for six bucks. Not worth it for me. El Segundo. For $13, now I'm gonna wait. You can see the comfort has already opened up and uh, the queue's moving, it's okay. We wanna cherry pick to Long Beach. And this is where the patience comes in. I just made this thumbnail for my YouTube video and then the video's right here that's gonna get uploaded that I edited this morning. Double offers, this is good news. Let the other drivers take it. And right now the video is getting uploaded on one of my channels where then I'm gonna grab the transcript I'm gonna grab the transcript and use that to create my title and description and chat GPT and then post it on my main channel there you go now it's being uploaded on my main channel also and the only thing that's left to do is the title and description needs to be updated and one of the things you guys always ask me is how, how are you so patient look I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna check my comments, and uh, I'm gonna respond to all these comments right now while I'm waiting. And right here, I'm gonna respond to my WhatsApp group, see if there's any messages here, and just kinda get caught up and kinda let everybody know what's going on. And uh, that's how I spend my time. So right here, Mike is basically talking about how to detail and clean the glass. And then I asked him, yeah, let me know, cause I wanna learn how to clean the glass on my in my car and how to detail it okay $28 to Los Angeles uh, to go 18 miles that's good money but you know honestly I want to go towards Long Beach I'm thinking about it yeah I guess I thought too long like if I get a ride for 20 bucks to go to Long Beach I'll do it because I know from there um, I can probably get the airport again and get, end up in Orange County and it's just my route that I run but that $28 ride was not bad not bad and right here are my stats for this week so far Tuesday I took a day off so made around $37 uh, Monday I made around 145 and today I'm at 80 I'm trying to get to 150 possibly 200 so we're at 264 I'd like to end the day at around 400 if possible. And if you look down here, I've only been active around close to eight hours. The 25 hours doesn't make sense because I leave my app on even when I'm home. And 10 trips is good. Uh, 10 trips for $264 is very good. 
and you can already see the tips are coming in. $76 in tips is very good. Have you figured out where I ended up by looking at the video right here yet? Ooh, double offers. Los Angeles, no. Culver City, no. And this is UberX. It's supposed to be full right now. Come on, baby. Get me to Long Beach. Oh, yeah. That's it. 62. That is a good amount. And it goes to Irvine. Come on, baby. Match me, baby. Match me, match me, match me. I clicked that fast, Uber. You're taking too long. Oh, God damn you, Uber. Hey, but you guys know it's worth waiting here because you can get a nice $62 ride on a Wednesday. If I don't get matched, I can't control it. There it is, $20 to Long Beach, finally came. Almost took two hours. So hopefully I can still hit the airport at Long Beach. Oh, it's still trying to match? Come on, bro, match my butt. All right, we got it. Let's go, we're going, Mr. Luke, we're coming. I ended up dropping off the customer in Long Beach right by the airport. I waited almost almost two hours for this but I think it's worth it and what is your rating 495 perfect well the taxi line is full um, which is fine and uh, there's about a hundred people waiting but there is a lot of drivers there's at least 20 drivers picking up people it's a Wednesday let's see how mr. Luke is doing He's all the way at 21a which is the furthest you need to go to pick up somebody. Oi. How you doing? I'm doing good, my friend. Welcome to California. <laughs> Unless you're back home. <laughs> no, I came from Michigan. Oh, fair enough, fair enough. Yep. It's gonna start heating up a little bit. Yeah, it's 90 in Michigan, surprisingly. What do we got? I think we're at, what, 70? Is it 70? 74 right now but you're by the beach you'll be all right yeah. oh. okay let me double check your address 2931 Palo Verde Ave 2931 Palo Verde Ave do you know do you know what the venue is sweet 102 sweet 102 that's what it said yeah okay we'll figure that out when we is it like a hotel or a business no, it's a business. Kind of business? Thing. Okay. So you work, working out here? Yep. You do something fun? Uh, yeah, it's pretty fun, pretty interesting. Fair enough, fair enough. Yeah. I always tell people if you got a hobby and you're making money and you enjoy it, that's the best job. That's the best job. You don't dread going to work every day. No, no, not at all. Or you gotta make the best of it. Uber's not the best job, but you know, yeah. I make the best of it. Yeah, it's not too bad. I've done it before. But not like this. This is crazy out here. Dude, I, I, dude, I waited like two hours for your ride. Yeah, it's, it's, uh, there was a nice one before you going to Irvine, and I, I didn't match for it. I was like, damn. Then I was like, next best option is Long Beach. Yeah. How far is Long Beach away? I showed about 28 minutes. 28 minutes? Yeah. We should be okay. There shouldn't be too much traffic right now. Okay, just dropped off Mr. Luke and look how close we are to Long Beach. Let's check, 31, it's 12 o'clock. Oh yeah, I can still hit it. So I gotta go there fast. So I gotta do my notes hella quick. But we'll let this $20 come in. It's a business trip. We were talking, a good chance for another tip. There you go, $102 and three trips. 20 bucks and now the goal from Long Beach is to get to uh, Anaheim so I can go home from John Wayne Airport. All right, check it out. We're right here. I'm right here and I took the freeway 405 all the way down. Hardly any traffic. This is why I like coming to Long Beach. Quickly study this. 23 miles is fine. 20 bucks is fine. 34 minutes is fine. The tip all depends on the young customer that I just dropped off and details ooh 55 dollars lord have mercy well his business is paying for it he's in marketing and medical sales but this is good see 14 dollars for service fee means a good chance for a tip 16 dollars for commercial auto insurance is 30 34 dollars went to uber 
If $34 went to Uber, we got 20, we got way less than 50%. But on these rides, typically you end up getting a tip. You just watched episode 18 of The Art of Cherry Picking. And very soon, I'm gonna be archiving the first 10 episodes so they will be available for members. Make sure you download them as fast as you can. And in the next video, you're gonna find out how I got or how I cherry pick the next customer. Right now, we're at around $100 and three passengers. That's not bad. I gotta leave a little bit of curiosity for you. Make sure you check out the next episode where I'll show you my perfect route for driving in Los Angeles. Let me recap so far. I drove from Chino all the way to Pasadena where I picked up my first customer for $50. That customer was dropped off in Beverly Hills where I picked up the next customer and I went to LAX for another $31. That was $82 back to back and now I picked up the last customer for $20 and I ended up in Long Beach right next to the airport. Have you figured out the route yet? I avoided going towards West Hollywood because there was a lot of traffic, the customer's rating was low, as well as a lot of street driving. We don't want that. So the perfect route so far is what? Pasadena to Beverly Hills, Santa Monica, downtown LA, end up at LAX and then from LAX you want to go towards Long Beach. It's almost like I'm making a circle from Chino to Pasadena to Beverly Hills to LAX to Long Beach. Then I want to end up in Orange County and then from Orange County I want to end up in Chino and I'll be back home. It's a full perfect circle. Now for you, just figure out wherever it makes sense for you and stop driving in areas where there's a lot of traffic and when there's a lot of street driving, right? You're wasting time, right? Figure out the perfect route for you. And right now, look, it's Sunday. Saturday, I drove, made $310 in seven passengers. And that video is gonna come probably next week. And I did the same exact route as this one. So on a weekend, this route can make you $300. On a weekday, this route can make you $200. Are you a rideshare driver? Would you like to be interviewed by me? Uh, do you have tips, tricks, and hacks that will benefit the rideshare community? My email address is right here. Give me an email. Let's help the other drivers. That's it. And check out this next video that I have linked for you. I also have the playlist linked for you. Enjoy. Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing.